Rohit, what would you say happens in Santosh Sachdeva's presence and what do you experience in her meditations? See, to me, I experience Santosh always as Shiva. So, I am very clear that even though she is a female teacher, what flows through her is that presence of Shiva. You know, so there is that immense calm to begin with and there is a level of energy transmission which I find incredible. But most of all, when you are sitting in her presence, when you come and meditate with her, this is what I find. Stillness begins to develop. The body begins to become still. The mind begins to become still. The emotions become to begin still. And the Kundalini which is running all around your mind, body, emotion, that also begins to become still. Your prana, your ki becomes becomes still. And certain quality of growth or evolution, I don't know what to say about it. But you have certain issues, you come and sit with her and without your knowing it, those issues begin to get resolved or at least something opens up, a dimension opens up which you would not have. Uh, if you were doing it by yourself or trying to find the solution by yourself. So she does not ever say anything much. She teaches almost as an afterthought. She will just make a small suggestion or she will drop one sentence and that is the way she teaches. So her teaching is not formal, her teaching is not rote and systematic, her teaching is not a checklist of activities and actions that you must perform. Just sitting with her is the greatest teaching I feel or the greatest benefit because that is what in the oldest and the most powerful form of being with the teacher. It is the process called Sanadhi which is different from Darshana or Dhyana or you know all those classical things where the person just sits becomes what is called in the tradition a hollow bamboo and allows the force, the Shakti to flow through. If you are receptive, you can pick up as much as your body and your mind and your emotions and your prana can tolerate because the flow is infinite. So in that sense, the more you get to sit with her, the better. Though it's not necessary to be physically present because once the energy connection is established, you can just think of her and the energy flows anyways. But it helps if you're coming and physically sitting, it helps. But I would say that the gift of calmness the gift of stillness that she offers is immense you know because she is not uh, an intellectual or a knowledge based kind of teacher she is a experience based teacher so she can offer you that experience and the stillness that she has found the the calm that she has found depending on your receptivity you can access it very easily and that is quite an extraordinary thing actually <laughs>